Bree Botanicals is the Yadi brand of home ground skincare products with a vastly developing line of specially handcrafted organic beauty soaps, body oils, and butter for the entire family, and not butter that you put on the bread. Well, maybe you could have put it on the bread and then rub it by your skin. We don't know. Um, with me now is the founder. Um, Sabrina Hilton. Well, go on. Morning. Welcome. You good? Good morning. Good morning. I'm good. Thank you. All the very, very best to you and your Thank family you. for 2024. Thank you Bree so much. Botanicals. You're from St. Elizabeth. I am. Yeah. I am. And by the way, born she, and bred. Yeah, she checked me a while ago. <laughs> I need to tell you now. So she come in the studio and says she can't wait for me to talk to because she come from St. Elizabeth. Can you imagine? Right. So yes. you alone doing the interview, then I'll tell you apologize to me. <laughs> no, not, not today. Oh, you know, apologize today. Oh, not today. When you started this? Well, this started in 2020. I started in 2020 as a hobby. So I saw a post on Instagram. This, this was in the height of the pandemic. I saw a post on Instagram that said, if you have not gained a new skill during this time, then it's not that you didn't have the time. You just didn't have the discipline. So You're they pretty lazy. much called me lazy. <laughs> <laughs> I, take offense. I took offense to it. I took offense to it. And then um, I went, because initially started as hair oils, like I wanted to do something around that area because I had really good locks at the time. Mm -hmm. And I just wanted um, a product that is made in Jamaica for Jamaicans. Um, however, I went onto YouTube, started researching, and I came up with soaps. And I'm saying, I am somebody with sensitive skin, so if I could build a brand around something like that for people like me, then, of course, um, that's where I came up with the idea Great for story. Can you remember the very first one you made? What, what was oh, it? It was atrocious. <laughs> it was really <laughs> bad. It was really, I still have a sample of that. I probably should have taken it here. It had a little bit of lather. It had a little, <laughs> little but it bit. Was, yeah, but it was, it was really bad. I posted that one on my Instagram. It's there as a reminder of where I started. So. Um, but hold on. So how you know you never got it right though? Because based on the process and based on what it should have looked like in the end, it didn't. It was all lumpy and everything. <laughs> so it wasn't good. So it you never decided to make your with this? No, no. I tried again and then my friends and family were the guinea pigs. So whatever new formula I came up with, I would have them try it um, and give reviews and so on. So constant research has made it better. Yep. You've brought you know. soaps and butter. Anything else? Or what's, 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 what's these over there? So these here are my babies. Yeah. These are my specially curated body oils. They can be used on your face depending on your sensitivity. They're lightly fragranced, but it's a, it's, a, it's a set of high quality oils that are good for your skin. Um, and this is based on research that I've done. When you say um, good, what, what you do, you just rub it on your skin. Yes, so there. typically after you have had a shower, it's yeah. the best time to do it because your skin is loose and supple and can absorb um, all of the, the, whatever you put on it. Beautiful. So after you take a shower and while your skin is not like wet, but a little bit damp, then you'll apply it and it gives you that constant okay. glow and for the And the butter day. does what apart from up on the bread? <laughs> <laughs> so the, the body butter um, has a blend of um, shea butter and cocoa butter. And those are known as great moisturizers. Okay. So if in case you're not like a lotion person or, you know, cocoa butter is known to help with stretch marks. Okay. So, Typically, if you're not a fan of those and you just want that, then you can obviously yep. try coconut. So I'm seeing neem and tea tree, I'm seeing turmeric, I'm seeing charcoal. How, how you know you get the, what's the word I want? See, what's the word I want? How you know you get the, like how much turmeric must put in and how much oh, other thing? Oh, what's okay. the word? What okay, is that okay. Word? okay. Um, blend, balance. Yeah, yeah right. right. Oh, oh. How so you typically know? there are... So I have formulas. So there okay. are calculators online that allow you to use formulas to, inc to to make the products. So for example, it will tell you, for example, one teaspoon of turmeric per Beautiful. pound of That's oil. So want. there's right. a lot of formula Beautiful. out you, there. You also, it seems to be gift baskets yes. here. And what, yes. What's in this one right here? So okay. this one here has a charcoal yeah. soap. It has one of the body oils as well as a butter and a little um, treat that yeah. people like, for example, like chocolate. This yeah. is Ferrero Rocher chocolate. And what's that and, one? And um, this one is a little bit simpler. It has um, a facial tissue as well as the oil and a soap. And in this fellow here? Yes, this one is the cost effective one. It just has the soap and the oil and rose yeah. petals. Where do you so sell your stuff? So I'm pretty much online at the moment. So if you would like to order, then 
you can send me a DM on Instagram or you can always WhatsApp me. Or um, Brie underscore. Brie underscore botanicals. botanicals on Instagram. I know these things. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Brie underscore botanicals on Instagram and um, you can get to me. Is this it or is this is a, still a, like a side thing for you? It is, I'm hoping it will be my future, but currently it's a side right. um, part because I am a full-time um, consultant okay. at a financial institution in Jamaica. I do project management oh, for them. So, so is the plan to have a this. physical space to sell Absolutely. Them? Absolutely. The plan is to have a physical space as well as expand into other markets okay. um, because I've been to places where you have very few Jamaicans and I've seen, for example, black Jamaican castor oil. Right. So there is a need for the brand overseas. People like brand Jamaica right. overseas. Do you plan to brand uh, branch out into anything else or are you just going to stick with this? Yes. So for the medium term, I'm looking to add some more products to the line in terms of a full skincare routine, um, possibly a sunscreen because in Jamaica we tend not yep. to yep. wear sunscreen. So I'm looking to formulate an organic sunscreen um, that will help us in our Beautiful. tropical What kind brands. of support have you got thus far? Um, the support has been great, especially from associates, especially from family and friends. Oh, they're my, as I said, my guinea pigs. <laughs> so yeah. the support has been great. I've been to pop-up shops, Kings and Night Markets. I've been to other events, um, flea markets and so on. So yeah. I'm trying brilliant. to get the brand And brilliantly there. explained, by the way. Thank and you. I'm impressed with that. You, you, you tell you. us exactly what I'm going. <laughs> All right, so Brie underscore Botanicals, if you want to support her, and please support her. She has uh, good stuff. Any Thank other, uh, apart from what we have here, any other I mean, do you have charcoal, you have turmeric in it? Yes. Anything um, else? Yeah, this is pretty much the line okay. at this point, yes. All right. It's pretty Fantastic. much in terms of soaps and oils. Yeah, man. And Good to see you. Blessings. Thank you. And Thank have, you. have a great year. Thank uh, you she's so the founder much. of Brie Botanicals, and her name is Sabrina Hilton. Yes. We have a giveaway, by the way, for our Smile Jammers. This was um, an interview Sim did earlier, and if you can name two artists performing at the Love in the Garden show. The number will come up. It's 733-2462, 733-2463. And you could win a couple of tickets to the event. We still have um, more on Smile, much more actually. Um, so stay with us. We'll soon come. See you.